Welcome to Techie Jack. In this video, we will see how to install the Let's Encrypt SSL certificate to the domain in the CWP control panel. So let's move to the control panel and get started. So let me log into the CWP panel. Here we have added our account and the domain is testingo.in. Right now, if we see, we have an error that is a privacy error for the SSL certificate. Before installing the SSL certificate, make sure that the DNS is propagated properly. In order to install the Let's Encrypt SSL certificate, you need to go to the web server settings and here you have a SSL certificate and you can see the list installed. That means there is no installed certificate right now. If we go and click to this auto SSL free and choose the domain that is a testing. This is a user account and the domain is testing dot in and additional services mail webmail FTP and cPanel let's try to install the auto SSL for this domain let me click on install it's validating it now you can see that it is installing please wait so let's wait for a while so you will get this message that installation got successful if we see the list installed certificate you can see the certificate is installed and 89 days are left to renew it and if we test it you can see here testingo.in resolved to this IP server type is this nginx and it should be trusted by all major web browser and all the correct intermediate certificates are installed correctly listed in the certificate you can see the common name and the authority is let's encrypt so our certificate has been installed successfully let me close this and let's try to open the site once again now you can see when i refresh the page we have a ssl certificate here and you can see it is from the let's encrypt and our test page has been loaded successfully so we have successfully installed the ssl certificate on our domain that is testingo.in once you do this the first installation of your ssl certificate you can see here the host name still has this HTTP error. So what you can do after installing this certificate, you can go to the server setting and click on this change host name and you need to just click on this change host name to install the certificate to your host as well. Let's wait for a while. You can see now the host name changed successfully. After you do this, you can just reboot your server once. So let's click on reboot the server now. Let me try to re-login. Earlier there was a privacy error and let's try to log in here. Still it's showing us error. This can be due to the cache. If we open in incognito, you can see here there is a SSL. Connection is secure. Certificate is valid. And the name of the domain is cwp.testingo.in and it is from the Let's Encrypt. So it is installed but here it's not showing just because of cache see here now it is there and if you see the website our cwp.testingo.in also have a proper SSL there that is from the let's encrypt if I try to log in we are successfully logged in and you can see we have a proper SSL so we have successfully installed the SSL on our domain that is testingo.in and we have also installed the SSL on our host name that is cwp.testingo.in and if you want to create some more account, you can go to the user account. First, you have to create the new account and you have to put the domain username and create the account. Your account will be created. I hope the video was informative. Let's meet in the next video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this video and want to see more, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell icon to get notified whenever I post new content.